Korea, who is facing incitement to violence and hate speech charges had in 2015 been issued with a bond of 5 million shillings and a cash bail of a million shillings. He was directed to pay the increment within a week or risk a jail term. The Office of the Director of Public Prosecution in its application to have his bail terms cancelled argued that the Gatundo South lawmaker has continued to utter hate-related remarks even after he was freed on bond. Meanwhile, former Lugari member of Parliament, Cyrus Girongo, has been summoned to appear in court this Friday to answer to criminal related charges. This is after the prosecution applied for the summons to be issued against him. The prosecution alleges that he gave out false information to the Directorate of Criminal Investigations. According to the charge sheet, on the 27th of March last year at DCI headquarters in Nairobi, he lied to a police officer that he had paid 7 million shillings to the son of retired president. President Jonathan Moy as a balance for the payment of a company, information that would have led to the arrest of Jonathan as an accomplice in the alleged fraudulent purchase of the company. Finally, four suspected Al-Shabaab brides have made an application before a Mombasa High Court to have their cases referred to the Chief Justice William Otunga and a three-judge bench formed to adjudicate the matter. The four, Om Keir Sadri Abdallah, Khadija Abubakar Abdukadir Mariam Said Abud and Halima Aden were initially charged with being members of the Al Shabaab terror group. They were later released on a half a million shillings cash bail each by senior principal magistrate Richard Odeño last year. Haligan Agade, Scales of Justice.